Use Cave of Crystals to answer the following questions. 1. Based on the information in the article, what can the reader infer about the Cave of Crystals? A. It's a one-in-a-lifetime amazing and accidental discovery. B. It took hundreds of thousands of years to create the Cave of Crystals. C. The mine owners are worried about people's safety in the cave. Or D. The mine workers are rich. 2. What conclusion can the reader make about the mine owners? A. The mine owners want to find more amazing discoveries. B. They appreciate the value of the priceless crystals. C. They are looking to sell the crystals piece by piece. Or D. The mine owners don't want the crystals to get any bigger. Use places and names a traveler's guide to answer the following questions. 1. The poem is written from the point of view of a A. Mine worker B. Explorer C. Writer D. Reader 2. Based on the poem, what can the reader conclude about the speaker? A. The speaker wants to discover a place no one has seen before. B. The speaker appreciates discovering new places but enjoys doing so by poems. C. The speaker wants to go to all the places they listed. Or D. The speaker likes seeing new places and writing about them. Use Cave of Crystals and Places and Names a Traveler's Guide. 1. Which sentence best describes a difference between the article and the poem? A. The article describes what is required to make a cave of crystals, while the poem talks about the places you can find the crystals. B. The article discusses a crystal cave while the poem does not. C. The article consists of factual information while the poem discusses the places you want to travel. Or D. The article describes the cave of crystals while the poem describes the Great Wall of China. 2. Which idea is expressed in both the article and the poem? A. Exploring will lead to great discoveries. B. Discovering new places can be exciting as well as rewarding. C. It's important to travel to as many places as possible. Or D. Going to new places is worth the risk. Number three. What is one difference between the selections? A. The article explains a specific discovery while the poem discusses many places. B. The article discusses different types of cave crystals while the poem does not. C. The article describes the crystals in detail while the poem describes many new places in detail. Or D. The article informs readers about the intense heat of the cave while the poem does not. Number four, five, and six. I will read them all together because they are all exactly the same. Write one comparison or contrast on the lines below and make sure to use your logical connections chart for help. You also need to make sure that you are using your sentence stems. Each of these will count off if you do not use your sentence stems or you do not use your logical connections chart for help. 